only like Dr. Boom is a bit better when there are actually minions on the other side of the board. Okay. And uh, like it, it, there was only a shield maiden at that point, so uh, Dr. Boom looks more uh, efficient here. Although I think that, that like he would not get punished for playing it last turn. Right. But he didn't know that. And now of course with two Dr. Booms, we just scratch our heads and go like, "Yep, anything goes." Right. Yeah. Let, let's see this RNG fest play out. RNG fest indeed. Uh. Do you want a whirlwind first? Because otherwise, if the boombots hit the harvest golem, you're really sad. Yeah. I, or I, the boombot too, right? I mean. Yeah, exactly. So you might just want a whirlwind immediately. It's not unreasonable. It also like pops the divine shield of the Noyotron. That's it, true. It, it does a lot of stuff here. Yeah, I mean, it's it kind of like uh, a 50-50. Uh, yeah, and, where and, and you can just execute the uh, Doctor Boom. I actually like the whirlwind first, so that the boombots have more targets that they can possibly be better at. Uh, this whirlwind will be exciting. Like it, this whirlwind can be a huge cider in the game. Okay, I think uh, we have to cast this really bots. fast. Because when this whirlwind comes out, things are gonna fly everywhere. Okay, let's see. Okay. Oh, that's a four. Oh, that's a three. three. And, uh, that's a three. Oh, oh that's a two. No. Wow, that is a god whirlwind if I ever seen one. Yeah, the Fisher knows this RNG. Wow, those two boom bots actually snipe both the Lothab and the uh, Spider Tank. It just yeah. kills them. Oh, that was insane. No, that was a board clear. Gnimsh can't be 